Hi there, my name is Mike. Uh, I've been um, spending a bit of time over the last couple of years getting into bonsai, and I've been very happy and lucky to have a local group, KW Bonsai Society, um, that is I'm a member of. I'm kind of inspired. It seems like a lot of people are recording their journey, and so I thought I'd do the same thing. Uh, this weekend, I went to Tropical Bonsai in Hamilton and got a couple of Fukien teas. Um, the one I want to start with here is the non-dwarf variety, and I'd like to share this uh, my, my first uh, impressions with you. Okay, so here's the tree. I'm not exactly sure how old it is. I'd actually be quite curious if anybody wants to make a, a guesstimate on that. Um, it's, I'm going to wait until spring to pot it. I'm very curious to kind of dig down to find, uh, learn a little bit more about the Nabari, but I think it's pretty clear where the front of the tree needs to be in this case. Um, let me just rotate it here. I, I think it's where I'm starting, but, uh, you know, what do you think? If we continue to rotate it, everything gets very linear and you lose a lot of the movement. To me, this is the back of the tree. Um, the branches are leaning, or the, the trunk is leaning towards me now. And my feeling is that that's not, uh, I guess you could always plant it differently, but um, that's not where I want to go. And again, we've got a side view. So again, I think it's pretty clear that this should be the trunk, at least to me. Um, and so I'm going to, uh, well, first thing uh, I want to do, it seems to me, is trim or otherwise move this branch, um, which is really in the way of the trunk line. I'm thinking, and I know these Fukien teas are, are actually quite brittle, so I'm a little hesitant to do a lot of wiring. I thought I'd start with some trimming. Okay, so here goes. Um, if I keep up with this, I'll definitely want to get a tripod. So this is me learning a little bit about um, making these recordings. But um, first thing is this branch here is um, covering up the, tree, uh, the, the, uh, the trunk. And so the easy decision, I think, is to cut... Here we've got this straight branch that's not at all interesting and again getting in the way. So I'm going to cut that off, see what we're left with. I actually took off more than I was expecting or planning to, but I think that other uh, branch that was going upwards, I mean, maybe I could have moved it down, um, uh, but uh, it's probably for the best. So I think what I will do since I don't want movement this way, is I'll clip this part off as well and see what I think about that. Okay, for now, I think I'll keep that, this piece right here. Um, it's small enough and again, perhaps I can get, I'm not sure if I want, I certainly don't want movement down, do I? Maybe I'm gonna end up actually taking this off entirely Time will tell, but I'll be interested to see if there's any comments. Now, what about this section here? Certainly, I like the fact that it's coming out from the turn here and on the outer portion. Can I move it a little bit more horizontally? Definitely need to be careful about this. I think this first attempt will just be clipping and not wiring. So um, there's a bit of a dead breath spot here so I'll take that off um, let's see this is fine what about this section that's going upwards um, so I don't know if you can see but we've got a branch that's basically going horizontally a little bit downwards but horizontally and then we've got one going up and one going again Horizontally, I certainly want this one. Do I want to take this one out? Um, 
I think so. All right, I'm gonna clip that as well. Generally, what I'm looking for is horizontal movement. All right, well, I, I don't think I'm gonna trim off another one of these. I could theoretically take this one off as well, but I'm not that brave. So for now, I could leave it like that. Now, what about this guy? He's, if you can see that, there's a little part that's going upwards and backwards, which is a very thin little branch here. I kind of think removing it is the thing to do. Yeah, I'm pretty sure of that. All right, here we go. I'm gonna spin this around so I can, hopefully you're able to see it okay from the back, but uh, let's see here. Remove this. I'm feeling very brave today and not, sometimes I'm a little bit more cautious about these cuts. Okay, okay. Uh, trim that a bit more. I do have knob cutters, which I should probably be using. One sec. One sec. Hopefully not to slow things down too much, but better be prepared with some different cutters. All right. <clears throat> okay. Just try to get a nice flush cut and hopefully that heals well there. Okay, so now we've got this, I like that. Yep, I think uh, now we've got some space here. Again, I might end up wiring this a little bit, but given how brittle it is, I'm not confident about that one yet, so we'll leave it. Now, interesting. If you look at the branch, it goes upwards, and then spirals down a little bit and then out, which I like. Uh, I have another fr friend and member of the club who, when he was uh, recording his video, Zin, hi Zin, he, I think this is kind of similar to something that he took exception to. Of course, I'm not going to, I don't have the um, ability really to to take that one out. It's, it's pretty integral, isn't it? So, um, okay, so we're going to then think about as things continue to go up. Um, and I'm literally just speaking off the top of my head without really any pre-planning here. So we've got two branches, one that goes left and one essentially that continues right. And so I'll just think about this one to the right. Um, have no problem with this one going outwards, uh, other than maybe the fact that it is then going up, sorry, it's going out and then it's going up. And I wonder if that's just competing with this main, main branch, and I think it is. So I'm thinking, rightly or wrongly, that I like the branch, but I don't, I want to cut it where it progresses upwards. So how am I gonna do that? Okay, my hope is that the small branch here is going to continue to do well, and that if I cut this off, I'm still going to have a decent branch that is, again, more horizontal. And let's just, ooh, let's cut that off. I'm definitely speeding through this, maybe a little too quickly. Uh, okay, so now, okay, I like that. Hopefully that'll grow in. Now we've got a branch that goes inwards. Now, inward facing branches, generally not preferred. I don't know if that really qualifies in this type of a, a plant, but uh, you know, I know enough to be dangerous. So that's what I, that's my first impression is I wonder if I cut this. Mm, I'm not sure, I am not sure. Let's see how, how big it is. Okay, so it's going up here. Don't want to be overly aggressive on this, but we've got good 
growth up further. And this does feel like in, it's going into the tree. And then also right now, we don't have any definition between this branch and this branch. So I'm gonna be brave and cut that too. I wouldn't be so brave if I was not recording. I don't want it to keep you forever. Okay. Um, all right. Okay, I like that. I like that. There's some definition there. Um, I think for the top, I don't know that I really want to get too um, aggressive right now. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to look at this one. Now, so we've got this branch, maybe it's easier to look at from the back, that goes this way. Um, do we have any branches that are facing downwards? No, not really. Arguably this one here, maybe. There's a bit of a downwards facing branch. So, And it also is actually, again, moving inwards towards the main branch. So I think that's enough to make me think I'm gonna take all but the very start of it because this one is not moving downwards. This one is moving what essentially is backwards since we're looking at the back of the tree. So I think I'll leave that for now. Here's a dead uh, branch, so I will take that out. Hopefully you guys can see this, okay. Hopefully somebody watches this video someday too. Uh, okay, I'll take this one out too. Dead. Now, We've got this, okay, we've got a bit of dead little stub here, so we'll take, now what about this guy here? I didn't cut that off earlier, but I think I want to, don't I? Okay, yeah, I do. So we'll take, I'm gonna do the same thing as before and just cut it back. So I'm, if I cut that, is there anything left? I don't think so. I'm just gonna cut it. I'm Okay, one little bit of, uh, what's the opposite of bravery? I'll just cut it back like that for now. I don't want it competing with this branch. And so now we've got, I don't know if I need to do anything else. Let's take a look for now. Okay, so I think I'd like to see this branch. So I wonder if I want to get rid of this here. And I think the answer is yes. Ooh, I think the answer is yes. So there's, hmm. Okay. What the heck, Mike, you only live once. Uh, yeah, it's in the way, isn't it? So this is what makes me question myself, but I'll cut it back. And maybe that's sufficient. I, I could cut it entirely. Not sure. This might be a two-part video after I see some comments from people. Uh, okay, so now we've got this branch continuing to go uh, horizontally, which is great. What about anything? We don't have anything. Well, we have this. Okay, so theoretically, I could cut that only because it's going downwards. Cut it here or just cut it here and allow this to be... Mm. Yep, yep, oh man, okay. Should I take that off? Mm. Mm. Not sure, not sure at all. Um, okay, I'm just going to see if I can't just with my hands cover that up to see what we think of that. Okay, not sure at the moment. And since this is my first such video, maybe I can be 
um, uh, forgiven for not being quite as confident as I thought I was entering into this. I think I'm going to leave it at that for now. Put it back in my, um, under the lights and where the rest of my plants are. I would be very interested to see people's thoughts on this branch. Is this meant to go? This last piece. And then we've got, let's see, other than this little guy that I decided to save for now, we've got branches going upwards. This is particularly horizontal, so theoretically you could get rid of this, but I want to have some tree left at the end of this process. So, um, And then we've got this guy. Now here's a bit of dead branch, so I'll take that off. That's at least an easy decision. Yeah, okay. Well, that's the start. Um, nobody said I had to finish this all in one day, so... Uh, I hope you enjoyed this and I hope you enjoyed this and uh, please, uh, if you have any comments, I'd, I'd value them. Thanks.